We've been getting up at five every day of this week. You got this girl. She's still asleep. Oh. Coffee, coffee. In my belly. The best part about waking up early is definitely the fresh air. I'm just, oh, it feels so good. Jasmine's putting on some makeup. Go see her. Good morning. It's actually so cold and I love it. I'm wearing a jumper. It's so good. Jasmine's got work, so she's putting on some makeup right now. This week we're trying to get up earlier, so I'm up with her. So we can start the vlog together. <coughs> Welcome back to another weekly vlog. Welcome back. Just quickly, if you're new here, my name's Renee. I'm Jasmine. We live in Australia. <laughs> We're twins. Still live at home. I work in the operating theatre as a registered nurse. And I am a casual worker at a club. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to make Jaz a coffee while she does her makeup. It's 5.30 in the morning and she starts work at 7.30. She has to leave at 6. I'll make her a coffee. <laughs> I woke up this morning, I was like, guess what, Jazz? I woke up at 2.47 and I didn't sleep after that. I like tossed and turned until my alarm went off, which was six o'clock. And then Jazz was the same. It so was like, I got to bed at 10 o'clock last night and then it felt like I was trying to get to sleep until my alarm went off. That's how it felt. So- Are we stressed? If we can't like get our words out properly, that's why. We're also trying to be quiet because mom's still sleeping down the hallway. Mm. Anyway, I'm gonna pack some breakfast because I don't like to have breakfast this early in the morning. So I'm gonna put some granola in a bowl in a container <laughs> and <laughs> has anyone tried this oat milk it's, so it's actually pretty decent we normally drink the vita soy but there's none in the shops and then mum bought this coles brand milk the worst milk i've ever had in my life so jazz went to iga and bought a couple of these and these are like five dollars really expensive but really nice hmm yeah, what's that freaking naughty What the hell? Someone tell me that's Rick and Morty, please. <laughs> oh, my nails are so thin from the um, acrylic that I had on them and they're still kind of like growing back, so. They're really short. They keep on snapping off. Anyway, I just wrote my task list for today. I also wrote a task list for the whole week. Jazz and I also have a really big business planner that we bought. Um, it was very expensive and we kind of skipped, like we didn't really use it for January. Yesterday I was like, we need to get on top of this planner. We need to like sort our life out and like just improve our morning routines pretty much. This is what the weekly kind of setup looks like. Um, so it gives you like all of these days and I just wrote when I have work. I need to book plane tickets because for the end of the month we're going to Amy's party. I need to sort out my outfit. I want to clean the bathroom, uh, wash my car, service my car. So that's what I've done so far there. Uh, this is today's list. Schedule the weekly vlog. I've got Acro in the afternoon vlogging, which I'm doing now. Post a story and um, we want to get onto TikTok as well. That's my, that's my week. That's my week this week. It's 7.30 in the morning. I think I might go outside actually for some fresh air. Close my eyes. I'm gonna do some meditating. I am having a really bad mental health day today. I feel really like depressed. I'm just gonna say it, I feel depressed. I spent my morning editing the weekly vlog which it's pretty much done and then after i finished editing i think i got off the laptop around 12 30 and then i had like a shower to make myself feel better because i started getting a bit fidgety and then i've literally done nothing like I've, I've been on tiktok scrolling on instagram like i just don't have any motivation today i don't know what is wrong with me and this is my third coffee of the day i just made this it's 3 57 
I head to Acro at five o'clock, so I've got an hour. Just having a snack. Carmen's muesli bar. Quite nice. So yeah, that's my Monday. Not the best Monday. All I want to do is spend the afternoon with Jazz and drink a glass of wine. That's what I need. Good morning and happy Tuesday. So it's 10 past five in the morning. I don't have work this morning. I actually have work this afternoon, but I decided to wake up early because Renee and I are trying to get up more early. She still sleep. Anyway, I went downstairs. I wet my hair a little bit to like depuff it. It's not really working. Good morning. We actually got up early again. Well, I got up 40 minutes after my alarm, but I'm up. And for some reason, my hair is really itchy. Like my scalp is really itchy. I don't know what's going on. You can tell I've been scratching my hair. Anyway, we're gonna do our skincare. If you don't know, we use Lake Cura skincare and we got some new products that just came in. So we're going to do that. We're gonna start with a vitamin C cleansing cream. I haven't done anything to my skin yet this yeah, morning. Yeah, this is what our skin looks like. Well, I've got one breakout right there. But I feel like our skin is looking really good. Nothing sponsored, by the way. Like, we don't get sponsors yet. No sponsors. <laughs> Wet the face. Yeah. Mm, it smells so good. Mm -hmm. The next thing that we're gonna do is put a superfood hydro mist, which we haven't actually used this from Lake Kuro before. Kind of keen. Yeah. I actually just love a good spray. Oh my god, the spray on it is actually like I'm not just saying that. That's nice. Oh my, nice. it's a thick spray, and it smells really nice. Wow. Yeah. Wow. That's really nice. I'm really happy with that. Mm. We also got a travel version of this, and just letting you know this. Vegan, this is vegan, vegan skincare. <laughs> We've used this one before. This one's the Hydro Boost Serum. This one is full of hyaluronic acid, which like keeps your skin hydrated and just like, it keeps water locked in your skin or something. That's really good. Mm. It's like the most hydrating product. Yeah, I love it. So nice. Come on, something about doing your skincare, it's just like, I'm ready for the day. I'm excited about this. I'm excited about this one. So we normally use the Probiotic Balance, it's our favorite, but we got sent this one. This one's a superfood moisturizer. I just love the ingredients. It's got shea butter, aloe vera. So nice. Yeah, so this packaging's new, by the way. So you just push the button down and the stuff comes out. So one like that, and then you just go. I love the packaging. Go to the top. It's like really gu Gucci. Wow. Oh. It's like a thicker moisturizer. Oh my. Is, oh wow. Oh my god. Oh, the smell of it. Wow, I love our products so much. Yeah, me too. So good. Like I've tr we've tried a lot of skincare. This one makes the biggest difference to my skin. Yeah. Like Kura makes the biggest difference. I feel so really good. good right now. All right, well, that is good quality skincare. Yeah. Thanks for joining us for our little skincare routine right just there. Oh, it was a morning skincare routine. We are ready for the day. It's eight o'clock in the morning. I actually feel accomplished. We scheduled the weekly vlog. It's Tuesday. Happy Tuesday. And we booked plane tickets for yeah. February, the end of this month, Amy's birthday. So we booked those plane tickets and we thought it was gonna be a hundred dollars return, but <laughs> it was double that. 450. Yeah, so now it's like 200 bucks each, which reminds me I need to send you some money. So, fine. but right now we're gonna make coffee. Coffee, coffee, in my belly. We could go to Macca's. What? I'm kidding. I'm really liking the Macca's coffee, Lily. No, oh, that's actually pretty decent. They froth the milk pretty, pretty Yeah, and cool. you like sip it out of the sip cup. It's like a vibe. Sip cup. Mm. Plastic. Oh, it's actually cardboard. <laughs> Not the lid. And the cardboard's coated with plastic, little girl. She's so hard she to be sustainable. She needs a lesson. I know. <sighs> she needs right. a smack. She needs a smack, actually. That's what she needs. <laughs> Okay, we'll be back when we have coffee. One, two, three. <laughs> no. What? Yeah, what? One, two, three. And cheers. <laughs> Is it yummy? Mm. I like it. I don't even need vanilla in it. Mm. I'm 
I'm off to the beach. Made myself an iced coffee. And I've decided to get out of the house because I've been spending too much time indoors. And also I need to do more things on my own because I'm always, I've always got my sister with me. I just need to like break the ice and just do something on my own and then it'll just get easier and easier. I'm going to the beach. I don't even know what beach I'm gonna go to. <sighs> it's hot. My hair is a frizzball. So I'm definitely getting all my hair wet in the beach. Jazz has work this afternoon as well. She was not in the mood to go. You know how she is with her afternoon shifts. She didn't wanna go. So she is working all afternoon. I don't really, I don't get the night with her. Um, this week is actually a pain in the ass because I work from tomorrow, tomorrow's Wednesday, Wednesday to Saturday, and they're all night shifts and her shifts are in the morning. So it's like she finishes her work and I start work. So we just don't see each other for eight, like, I don't see her pretty much all week. I'm going to keep this hat on because we'll not like looking at that when I'm editing. <laughs> um, also, this week's focus for Jazz and I is to post more on TikTok. So I'm going to see if I can maybe create a TikTok. There's something about TikTok that Jazz and I get scared of. Like, we're scared of TikTok and we don't know why. Gosh, I might do a little, like, vlog on there or something. I need to get out of my comfort zone a bit more. So, yeah. So I'm going to take myself out today. I normally go out with my sister. That was alright, hey? Maybe I will do a TikTok vlog. Look, I don't know how to use TikTok and how to edit it. Okay, I made it to the beach and I've got the camera with me. I'm just like keeping my eyes peeled because if someone walks by, it's really challenging. It's got the mic and everything. So anyway. I am at Fingal Beach, which is the same beach as what we went to on Sunday because it was really nice last time on Sunday. I really enjoyed it. Like this beach, you get a nature walk before going to the beach. Like this beach is actually amazing. Fingal Beach, go to Fingal Beach. Found a nice little spot in the shade actually. But I do want a little bit of sun. Fuck, this beach is actually perfect. This is me. What a vibe. Okay, I just realized that someone's literally like maybe five meters or meters away from me and I didn't even see her, so um. Just got home from the beach, juggling everything out of the car right now bit of a struggle but oh, and then I dropped my keys sweet okay this is a really good look I've just been sitting in my car playing on my phone you know when you just like park the car and you stay in the car for like 30 minutes <laughs> scrolling yeah that's what I was doing hey, Barooni. Hello. Come on. this is my second glass of wine I only like poured it like not a full glass so it's eight o'clock at night and I've actually just been on my phone. I posted a Instagram photo. So I was just like replying to comments, doing some hashtags, doing some Instagram engagement. But right now I think I might start editing this vlog. So that's what's happening right now. Yeah, I'm actually really tired from going out tonight, today. Can't even think. The wine is actually making me really tired. So good though. I'm back. It is 10 o'clock at night and I'm back from work. Everyone's currently still sleeping, so I'm trying to be as quiet as I can. Lucky I've got this mic because I can just talk into it. I didn't say goodbye today. I just went to work and spent the whole afternoon at work. I've got to go to bed because, well, we are getting up at 5 a.m. like every day. But also, I have work in the morning. <laughs> Good night.
I take your order? Hi, can I please get a small vanilla oat latte? Okay, I know I could have made one at home, but I'm craving Macca's coffee. I don't know what it is. I it's a smack. I think it's, they've got this like new oat milk or like they have oat milk now, which they never had. And it just like tastes really good. Thank have you. Have a lovely day. Thank you, you too. See ya. Mm. I should have got a standard. Every time I get a small, should have got a standard. I've been a really bad vlogger today. Literally, it's 3.30 in the afternoon. I haven't left the house. It's okay, I left the house yesterday. I washed my car. Like, I am feeling accomplished after that. Washing your car, that's like a mission. What else did I do? I got up early. It wasn't six, well, it wasn't five. You know how we're like trying to get up at five. I think I got up like 30 minutes after my alarm. Um, so, and then I, I got a bit done in the morning. So I like edited this vlog. What else did I do? I feel like all I've done is edit the vlog and wash my car and then have a shower and scroll on TikTok. I actually posted two TikToks. Look at me go today. Follow us on TikTok, Hogan Twins. That's my solo date one there. I'm gonna take myself out today. Um, and then yeah, I just posted these two random ass TikToks, <laughs> these two, uh, today. So that also makes me feel accomplished. And I have work this afternoon, so I'm gonna get into my work outfit and then head off to work. I start at 5.30 and I, I think it's like a four or five hour shift. Also, my hair looks really crunchy because it is. I gotta crunch it out from the styling product that I put in there. So it's like you gotta let it dry and then you crunch all of the styling product and it just like make the curls look a bit more soft and beautiful. Um, the weather's changing. It's not as hot, it's not as humid. So we're bringing back the curls. I actually love this shirt so much from Thrills. Oh, just like the red and the, oh my God, I'm obsessed. Okay, there we go. Yay. Anyway, I need to get ready for work. Good afternoon, back from work. I just had a coffee, another coffee for the afternoon. I'm home alone tonight. Well, until mum and Daryl gets home and Renee gets home from work. But until then, I'm here alone. I've been watching YouTube videos. And then what was I just doing before? Oh, Instagram stories. So productive, like what? I didn't have a break at work today. So like when I got home, I just literally slammed into a wall. Like figure of speech. I can't be bothered to make dinner tonight. So I just, I just ordered pizza. It's cooking away. I'm gonna get it delivered because I'm not even bothered to drive to pick it up. That is lazy, 101. Mm, I got work tomorrow morning, nice and early. I'm trying to stay positive. It is really hard. Like it's so hard to stay positive when you're working long hours. Cause like, you know, you know how it is in my back and my shoulders. Oh, so much pain. Ooh, that's hot. Okay, garlic bread is actually my favorite food. Like hands down. Renee and I were talking about it and I was like, what's your favorite food? And we're like, mm, chocolate, but I'm like, mm, but what's something like, no matter what, like even if you're full, you could still have a little bit of it. Garlic bread. Garlic bread and chips. Hot chips. Mine's garlic bread over hot chips. But like garlic bread, like you just can't stuff up. You can even put garlic on any bread. Okay, I could talk about garlic bread for another 30 minutes, but I am hungry. I got a vegan veggie spicy trio domino pizza. Oh, if you could smell this through the camera. Yum. Normally I put barbecue sauce on it, but... I better not do that today. Good morning, happy Thursday. Today was one of the hardest days to get out of bed. Just about to go to work. Mm, it's like six o'clock in the morning. Ooh. I was almost gonna call in sick. I was like, I'm not getting out of bed. But here I am, I literally said out loud, I was like, you got this girl, jumped out of bed. But today's kind of my Friday. I've got tomorrow off, but I I am on call Saturday. So it's, hmm, could be better. But I'm gonna go get a coffee because I haven't had anything yet. It's my morning treat. It literally got me out of bed. I was like, oh, back is coffee.
oh, it's actually so nice outside. I've been inside all day today. Jazz had work this morning. I've got work tonight. Yeah, same as yesterday actually because I start at 5.30 again like yesterday. I don't know, I've been feeling really unmotivated lately. I write my task list for the day and then I don't do anything on it. Like I wrote grocery shopping, I haven't even been grocery shopping. I'm just finding it really hard to leave the house. Um, and I actually think I have cabin fever right now and I need to find like a way to stop me from feeling that. Yeah, like if I don't leave the house before like two o'clock, I won't be leaving the house. And then I find myself like walking around the house, scrolling on my phone. Um, it's just like really not that good. I haven't done any editing. Like I probably should have done a bit of editing. Um, I was actually messaging Jazz and we were, I was saying that we need to like focus on ourselves a bit more. But we don't really give ourselves time because we're always thinking about what kind of stuff we need to create. Um, anyway, this is just what's going on in my head. I just need to find a better routine. I don't know. Put a pimple on my back. Also, yeah, as you know, we live with our parents still, like mum and our stepdad, and they're going away for the weekend. So it's Thursday today. They're going away like from today and then they're coming back Monday, I think. So yeah, we get the house to ourselves. Um, Jazz finishes work at like 3.30, but I won't see her because I'm going to work. And then um, we've also got our brother and his fiance, our sister-in-law to be. Um, they're coming here tonight and spending some time with Jazz. I don't know if she's going to pick up the camera tonight, but that's what's happening tonight. And um, yeah, I've got work. I'm just feeling, yeah, I'm not feeling my best this week. This week's actually been kind of shit. I'm trying to be grateful and everything, but I've just been having these episodes where I'm like, no motivation. But look at my cat. Hello, big boy. I see a yawn coming on. Is a yawn coming on? Mm, big boy. Yeah, there it is. There it is. Hey. Anyway, that's what's happening right now. My parcel still hasn't arrived. I bought some pants from Culture Kings and I'm waiting for it to arrive. I got an email saying it, it was going to arrive yesterday and it hasn't arrived. So I'm hoping it's going to arrive soon. And then I also ordered... Yeah, I also ordered some things off this website. Like, I haven't heard of it before, but I was trying to find a top to go with my sparkly pants for my brat stole outfit. And so I ordered some shirts. I'm really excited to, like, show you what it all, what, what it's going to look like. Um, but the website's called, like, Yes. I'll put it on the screen. I can't remember the name of it. I just ate, like, spoonfuls of peanut butter. And now I'm, like, feeling a little bit sick. I'm also ready for my second coffee, but I think I am going to do a little bit of editing before I head off to work. So it's 2.55 and I'm gonna leave at 4.30. Um, I got back from work a while ago and Georgia is home. So we've just been chatting, drinking wine all afternoon, which is when I got dinner. Subway tonight. And we got two more bottles of red wine, so I'm gonna crack that. I'm gonna crack that, crack that wine. I'm say hello to the bowl. Yeah, so we're all drinking wine tonight. Even Ben, he's here tonight, <clears throat> and he's really loving the red wine at the moment. Um, I'm gonna drink my pepper jack. We're gonna crack two bo two bottles of red. You might as well. Yeah. Both of them. Yeah, just to give him a taste tester. Yeah, because Ben won't drink pepper jack. I think. Is this a little bit of bubbly? Oh no. George is drinking Moscato. Moscato. Oh wow, George. George doesn't drink. Okay. I like it actually. I like this one? Yeah. I am drinking like it. It just tastes like um sugar. <laughs> oh, do, you, do you remember the Moscato days? I had my Moscato days. Ends with a headache. Ends with a headache. Oh, I love it. So spicy. Can't like taste. pepper. Like pepper. Ah, and then day. can I pour yours and we can do like a taste test? Oh, Ben, I don't like the look of that one. I like it red wow. and thick. Look how see-through that is. It's like clear. Oh, I is like it, it thick. Is it? Let me yeah, see. Yeah, look. Oh, shit. It's watery. Where's the big knife? Um, you hate it. It's got spice. I'm surprised about that. Well, we're going to watch. What are we going to watch? Uh, I don't know. Something while we drink our wine and eat our subway. Poor Renee, she's missing out, she's at work. That sucks for her. <clears throat> Iron in the box though. Whoa, why is this? Mm -hmm. mm -mm. Fresh. Good morning and happy Friday. It is Friday. So it's 10.48. 
slept in today. We've been getting up at five every day of this week. So I thought, you know what? I'm getting up at eight. Yeah, it's almost 11 o'clock and I haven't had my coffee yet. Um, I don't know how. I got my coffee, I'm happy now. I need to make breakfast. I'm having like the latest breakfast. But like, I just like I'm not hungry in the mornings anymore. I don't know why. Anyway, I came home to a parcel last night and yeah, I haven't opened it yet. So I only got like four things off Princess Polly, I think of it. Princess Polly. Oh yeah. I got this little white long sleeve shirt. It's actually ribbed, I didn't realize it was ribbed. Just like put underneath tops like this. So like if I put this underneath this top, you would see like this poking out and then you would see like the nice sleeves coming out of the shirt. I don't know, it's like a vibe. So, and like winter's coming up and I still wanna wear my oversized tees, but I feel it'll be like really cold. So I can just like pop this underneath them. It's actually really good quality material. Like it's really thick. Oh, that's right. <laughs> that's cute. I don't really have one of these. I feel these can go uh, over, like even just like with like a um, turtleneck like this, these look really cute. Um, yeah, I got these little clips for the brat style dress up. <laughs> you know brats, you know those little tiny little claw clips that we used to, why am I blurring up? Um, that we used to put in our hair, in like the 2000s. These are the little clips we're going to put in our hair when we dress up for Amy's 21st party. These are cute, all different colours. And then I got a shirt, another shirt. Oh, wow, the material of this. I love the quality. Look at this. So it's kind of, it's halter neck tied up the top. But check this material out, the sparkles in it. It's one of those ones that kind of like fall at the front there. I don't know what you call that. Okay, so this shirt was a mission to get on. Like not a mission to get on, but I was like, I am gonna send this back because it is not nice. The way it sits is all wrong. Like, I don't know what they were thinking. And I even checked on the website. I was like, how is she wearing it? And what it looks like they've done. First of all, the girl on the website, um, she's got much bigger boobs than me, so. That's probably why, but I could not put this on without my, literally my nipples. Like you could just see them just sitting there. So I just tried to like play around with the front of it. And I literally put a, um, this safety pin, which came off the tag. I shoved it down there and I've safety pinned the shirt in itself. So it would sit like it does on the model. If I didn't do that, I would literally do this and you could just see my boobs. Um, so yeah, I put, uh, what do you call these? Chicken fillets? I've put chicken fillets in there because I feel like it looks better with a little bit more boob. And I don't want to wear a bra. I don't like seeing the bra, but like, I think I've made it work. Okay, literally my favorite item of clothing ever. If someone's like, what's your favorite item of clothing? A blazer, always. If I put a blazer and like have that nice material coming through, that's pretty. Okay, I thought I would try this one on as well. This one's really comfortable. And I actually got this one only to put uh, some oversized tees over the top. But it even looks good without it. Do you see what I mean? For winter. I think it's cute with the, fr like the frill. I like the frill on the ends. <laughs> All right, I'm just about to head off and see Renee. I'm actually really excited to see her, spend some time with her. I was just doing some Instagram stories in the kitchen. Wow, this lighting is lovely. Yeah, and I'm just like, I've just noticed this past week that I've been quite negative. And yeah, Renee and I wanna change, change our mindset. So we're reading like more self-development books and like just, even just like reading some happy quotes about like happiness and success, it's just, really inspiring. It's just about changing our thoughts because we do a lot of like complaining and going, I don't want to do this. I don't want to go to work. But instead of saying, I don't want, we're going to start saying, I want to go to work. Like I want to, um, I don't know. I can't think of anything I don't want to do besides work. But instead just go, yeah, I want to do that. 
and I feel like it'll it just empowers you like it makes you feel better about doing the thing that you want to do I read somewhere that humans have 60,000 thoughts in a day which is so true like I totally believe that don't let the thoughts dictate your life like let the thought come in acknowledge the thought and then just like kick the thought away and don't let it affect your life same with like self-love like self-love comes into every aspect of your life even to making a decision making a decision on what color coffee cup you want we struggle with decisions because it's a self-love issue because we obviously don't like our decisions we just go oh i want someone else's decision because i don't like my decision that's like you don't love yourself you don't love your thoughts or like yeah it's just like everything even going to work like i don't want to go work oh why because i'm just i don't know like i just don't feel good it's like, why don't you feel good you think you're not good enough in your job you don't think i don't know it's just like with everything so we're gonna this is what we're gonna focus more on in our life anyway i'm gonna go also I said on my Instagram just to like smile more because being being happy is so attractive. So yeah, just smile more at people too. Like if you see someone, just like give them a smile and see how they react. It will literally make their day probably. It is Saturday night, Saturday night, 7.30. And Renee's at work, I'm home alone. I fed the dogs, which is the crunching in the background. I just got back from work actually, cause I'm on call from three this afternoon to seven o'clock in the morning tomorrow. Yeah, it's like 16 hours that I could be called in. Um, so I just got back, so I ended up being called in. I was only there for like three hours. Just took out a gallbladder and then that was it. Really easy case. And I picked up some sushi on the way home because I can't be bothered to cook anything plus we need to go grocery shopping ASAP I went to sushi train hence why it's all pretty not much has happened today to be honest so we didn't Renee left really early she has another big shift today we're just like really tired this week hmm I'm loving Lauren Geraldo lately I'm watching all her vlogmas like I only just come across her She's so funny. Such a long time since I've spoken to you. Wow. Mm. I just finished work actually. It was only a three hour shift and now we have the afternoon together. So we're going to make the most of the afternoon and we're going to go to the beach and we're also going to get some dinner. We have no idea what beach we're going to and what dinner we're having. No. Just a spontaneous afternoon really. Yeah. So it's three o'clock. Didn't do much today. Renee just got back from work. You already said that. Mm -hmm. And I walked the dogs today. I'm, I'm just trying to think, is there like any updates? Because I didn't vlog Friday or Saturday. I didn't vlog because I was working like nine hour days those days and I was not in the headspace. Like I was mm. not an inspiration those days. So I didn't pick up the camera. Um, yeah, that's all right. But you got there. It's the end of the week. Congratulations. Yeah. Thank you. Work all starts again next week. Oh my God. Yay. <laughs> Let's have a nice Sunday afternoon together. Yeah. I'm excited. We're also going to get a takeaway coffee from McDonald's because they have oat milk now. Uh, we're going to get a hot coffee. We always have this debate whether we have an iced or a hot coffee. And Jasmine won the debate. I think we're going for a hottie. Yeah, well, we're getting in the ocean, so. Hi, could I please get two small oat lattes? Car. 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 I'm going to drive my car to... Uh, to British two. is almost exactly the same as Australian, except it's not. Except it's a bit pommy. That's <laughs> except it's pommy. <laughs> bit pommy, yeah. Cheers. How small are these little yeah, tiny should've cups? Should have got a standard. Should have got a standard Good every job. time. Then, it's not a latte. Oh, what is it then, Jazz? Flat white. Mm. All right. I found this new song. What do you think? Go. Cool. Ready, girl? Yeah. Quick outfit of the day, of the afternoon. Oh yeah, oversized shirt, some yeah. bike shorts, mm. with a uh, bandana. Uh -huh. Got me blue. You got your blue going on there. 
So we we're planning on actually swimming because we thought we needed salt on our skin, but we actually didn't end up going for a swim. We sat on the beach. We were like, mm, mm. do we feel like swimming? Not really. It was so windy and not a vibe. <laughs> yeah. So but it was still so beautiful. It was there. really nice to sit on the beach and just get the salt you know on the skin but yeah anyway we actually left we were there for like five minutes and then we went to grilled for some dinner yeah we really needed some food i'm pretty sure we were hangry oh that's what it was we were hangry yeah we ended up getting like the biggest burgers on the menu <laughs> we've never tried this beer before it was pale ale so it literally tasted like pasito and beer mixed together but anyway these burgers were really good we were really hungry so we actually got zucchini chips as well but they were kind of full of oil mm. but i feel like we're so negative right now it tastes like cheese balls or something because it's like gooey inside yeah. but the burger was actually 10 out of 10 yeah. highly recommend the vegan burger the garden goodness from grilled yeah. it's really good so good anyway we're gonna round this vlog up yeah it's pretty so, long yeah. as always <laughs> thank you for watching and um we'll see you in our next weekly vlog thank you for being here we're literally our family yeah and we'll see you next week yeah love you bye does that make a noise oh, it's gonna be so loud.